Hello, this is Dr. Derek Strachan, Divine Spine Chiropractic, and we're located in the old Ballard Firehouse in sunny, sunny downtown Ballard, and welcome to this week's health tip. So this week is our final segment of how to turn your results, your resolutions into results, and I'm excited to share with you that, you know, some people have, you know, jumped on board and are really working towards improving their health in 2013, and I hope you're one of those people, but what I want to share with you is a few things to think, consider to make sure that you are successful. You really need to be thinking about this as a job. So it's a commitment that you need to be making in your week, you know, as far as your time goes. But if you, if you take the, um, the approach that it's a job, then you need to really have a job description. You really need to know exactly what it is that you're wanting to achieve. And ask yourself, how would I be impacted by achieving this goal or goals for 2013? What kind of impact will it have on myself and on those people in my life that I care about? And so that's an important question to look at. The other thing I want you to consider is what will you say to yourself when you've accomplished this goal? How will you feel? What kind of reaction do you think you have? Like get really as descriptive as you can and really, you know, get attached to that experience that you're going to have. You know, is your self-esteem going to be stronger? Are you going to look in the mirror and feel really great about yourself? Will you be wanting to go to the next level? What is it that you're trying to achieve? These are all things to really consider. And, you know, think about the energy that you're going to be bringing to your experience on a day-to-day -day basis and the surroundings in your environment. How will that impact yourself or those people around you? So, <clears throat> you know, what does your perfect health look like? That's really what you want to be focusing on and really going after it. I find that people who are most successful are the ones that are being inquisitive. They're asking themselves these questions and really reflecting and you know, looking at what they wrote down two weeks ago and projecting forward, but also looking back and saying, okay, if this is what I want to accomplish, am I on track? If not, how do I need to modify it? What do I need to do differently to get myself on track? Or was my goal too high? Do I need to reset it? What, whatever it may be, but you need to be looking at it to make it successful, keep it fresh in your mind. And remember what was the reason, the big why. Why are you doing this? What's this, the purpose of this? And hopefully you're making it bigger than yourself because if you are, you're going to be more motivated to you know, make it happen. I always think about women who are pregnant. You know, this, you know, bringing a child into the world is much bigger than themselves and they almost always take better care of themselves so they can be caring for the baby. Think of it in those terms that like you want to think outside of yourself. And the other thing I want to mention is that when you're talking about mastery, this is a lifelong process. This isn't just about going to this goal and, you know, then you can stop. It's about making it a life habit, a way of taking care of yourself, a way of eating, a way of exercising, a way of thinking about yourself. And it, it transcends to other areas of your life. When you're talking about mastery, you can apply these concepts to all areas of your life, your financial life, your career, your emotional life your relationships, your parenting, it goes on and on and on. And that's why I'm excited to help you because here at Divine Spine Chiropractic, we want you to excel and have a phenomenal life in all areas, which is why we are bringing a program to our, to our um, people here at Divine Spine called Lifebook. And I'm going to be sharing more and more about that as the, as the weeks go on, but Lifebook is designed to help you achieve the life of your dreams, to attain all those goals that you, you've talked about, that you know that you want to do, but you're not sure how you're going to do it. So Lightbook will help you design that. And it fits very nicely with what we're trying to accomplish here in our mastery program here with your health and well-being for 2013. So if you have questions or if you're unsure about the, the previous two weeks, um, let me know and I can give you that information so that you can start applying those questions and start making it a reality. It's not too late to start. If you didn't start two weeks ago, don't worry about it. I, I'm proud to say that I've been on track with some commitments I made at the beginning of this year and I'm really feeling a lot better in my body and I'm excited about 2013 and many different reasons. But join me in the process and understand that it's never too late to start. Don't wait till next January. That's too long. Start today. Make today a commitment to yourself. Make one thing that you're going to commit to by the end of this day that you're going to do that's going to drive you towards a healthier you. And I promise you, it'll make a difference. All right, everybody. Have a wonderful rest of your week. I look forward to seeing you soon. And take care.
Yes, and I love you all, and we'll see you soon. Again, Dr. Derek Strachan, Divine Spine Chiropractic, located in the old Ballard Firehouse. Bye-bye.